the home side attempt to return to the top of the table. They take on a Chennai inside, desperate to get back to winning ways to keep their top six hopes alive. Manolo Marquez's men have won five in a row. It's usually Ogbeche and Severio or Kianese and Ogbeche, those, those are the combinations. And early on in the season when Ogbeche wasn't firing at all cylinders, Manolo Marquez has shown that he will play Kianese and Severio together as well. It's a decent competition between those three players for the two spots. Now Nintoy. Oh, wonderful feed from Nintoy! And just wide. What a run from Nintoy. Just breezing past a couple of players. There's a strong challenge coming in from Akash Mishra. Clever ball from Jiteshwar. But goes on the inside of Nim. Goes past a couple of players. And just needed that finish. And narrowly missed out. It's just that pressure coming from O'Day right at the end. Which kind of puts him off. It must be said. Brilliant defending at the end though from O'Day. Reading the intention of Ninthoy and making the block. Here, Sang one with a corner, looking tasty, and that's why Sliskovic will eat those up all evening. Chennaiin have found their way, and Hyderabad find themselves trailing at home. How many times have he said this? Get the ball to Sliskovic. All you need to do is get a quality delivery in. That's a beautiful ball from Akash Sangwan. Where is the marking though? He's always going to be the threat, the biggest threat for Chennai. But Obechi miss, misses that header. Akash Mishra doesn't get close enough. And in the end, that's bread and butter from Sliskovic. He's never missing from that distance. Cushion header past the goalkeeper. But Daric is thrilled. It is the first time Hyderabad have conceded from a set piece. And it had to be Sliskovic to break that record this season. And he's definitely had that defense. Got an assist tonight. He's created chances like he always does. He's put in a lot of crosses as well. Ooh. That's a shout. And it's a shout which has been given. Hyderabad. It isn't over yet. Well, that did look like a penalty to me as well. No complaints from Wafa, and you know he's just late to react. Has no idea that Severio is behind him. It's Akash Sangwan who gets a touch with his head. It's Severio who gets ahead of him. There he gets that touch. Severio so quick to just get ahead of him, and that's just reckless from Wafa. Should be doing a lot better in that position. He's experienced but gives away a penalty. And now it's time for Bart Ogbeche to step up. Massive moment in the title race. Yellow card was also shown to the keeper. Yeah, just some mind games from the young goalkeeper. And it's a pressure penalty right now for Badu Beche. Oh, Beche! We've seen time and again from Baruch Beche. The keeper goes the right side, but he just gets enough of power and puts it into the corner narrowly there. Samin Mitra almost gets fingertips to it. Duke does well to track back and get something on that block. 
Doesn't get the right connection in the end, Robbie. Full time. Hyderabad drop points. Their five match winning run comes to an end. Chennai in fought and fought hard, but simply couldn't do enough to win it. Yeah, and Julius Duque there, he's lying on the pitch because he's covered every single blade of grass. What a game he's had. Quality stuff, our hero of the match. An organized, compact performance from Chennai in. And Hyderabad almost as if slowing down after a remarkable run of victories and goals. But the title race is now in Mumbai City's favour. Duka with a heroic performance in the middle of the park to keep Hyderabad at bay. And at full time at the Gachiboli, it is Hyderabad 1. Chennai in one.